The snow continues to fall in the wake of winter storm Crystal. It's causing wet, slippery conditions on area roads, which has led to numerous crashes. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. Winter storm Crystal has certainly left her mark. Yes, the aftermath of the storm has roadways being shut down tonight as wet conditions turn to ice around northeast Wisconsin. And the snow continues to fall this evening, adding to the slippery conditions throughout much of the area. Here's a live look right now as the... Uh, as the snow falls in Appleton this evening from our College Avenue camera. Police are reminding drivers to slow down and take their time getting to their destinations this evening. Falling temperatures have bridges and overpasses icing over and that has led to several accidents as you see here in uh, 172 Bridge. Sheriff's deputies just a short time ago actually shut down both lanes of Highway 172 there over the Fox River due to the ice and the accidents. Traffic was also being rerouted to allow road crews to salt and sand the icy roadways. Deputies tell us glare ice started showing up around 7 o'clock this evening as those temperatures dropped. Accidents have also been reported on Interstate 43 in the Green Bay area. If you do have to travel, you're being advised to travel and drive slowly. One person was hurt in a multi-vehicle crash in Brown County this afternoon. The Brown County Sheriff's Department says it happened in the southbound lanes of Highway 41 around 2.30. As many as six vehicles reportedly went into the ditch near Shearing Road. One person was injured, but we do not know the extent of the injuries. Officials say the crash was a result of the snow and periodic whiteout conditions. 41 southbound was shut down between Highway G and Freedom Road for about an hour for cleanup. Interstate 43 southbound was shut down this morning after a semi slid off the road into a ditch. It happened around 2.15 near the Highway 172 exit. Traffic was rerouted for a short time so tow trucks could pull the semi out. Officials say snow-covered roads played a role in the incident. Area Sheriff's Department say they received a few calls about cars going into the ditch overnight. In Winnebago County, there were reports of 34 cars in the ditch since yesterday afternoon.